Let's see, and play, there we go. All right, I think we're, I think we're good to go. Um, all right, let's go ahead and get started. Hey everybody, thanks for joining us. I am thrilled and excited to go through the ASEA Compensation Plan. I love ASEA's Compensation Plan. It is second to none, it's incredibly generous, and it's one thing I really love to talk about because this is where we get the, the financial rewards. Um, look, I've discovered there's two kinds of pain in life. There's physical pain, we all know about that. There's another one that's called financial pain, and <laughs> for many people it can be very painful, and this is a great solution to financial pain to really get the rewards from your efforts uh, through, the, through the compensation plan. So let's go ahead and get started in this. Um, probably the first thing I want you to understand is that you don't need to be an expert on the compensation plan. Please don't think that you need to know everything about the compensation plan because the reality is, is, is you don't. Um, the best way to learn the, the compensation plan is to kind of have a long-term perspective, kind of have an idea of, of what the targets are and then just get started. Really, the, the thing that you need to know is how to achieve the next level. So, but we're gonna run through this, so I want you to just kind of sit back, have some fun, and uh, learn as we go here. So, you just need to work, um, you just need working knowledge. That's the best way to, 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 um, to learn this, is earn as you learn, as you go through, and learn by working the business. So, the one number one secret to your business is it's not, it doesn't matter what works, what matters is what duplicates. That's the important thing is it's all about duplication. So guess what? Um, modeling after a SIA corporate training video, this is, um, I would recommend uh, taking down, maybe jotting a few notes, uh, writing things down, but this presentation was modeled after Justin, uh, Justin Phillips did a presentation. Um, and so a lot of these slides, these ideas and concepts came from him. And I also need to give credit to BK in Singapore, who has uh, graciously um, uh, forwarded this PowerPoint to me because he's done an absolute magnificent job at uh, pulling together some concepts that I can easily explain this to you. So one of the first things that you want to do is to know what you want to achieve. You know, what is your target? What is your goal? I like to tell people, look, if you could have anything out of an ASEA business, if this was a vehicle that could reach any of your goals, dreams, aspirations, what would you want out of an ASEA business? Uh, you can actually afford to dream and you can afford to dream big with ASEA. ASEA has paid out over $158 million in commissions to literally thousands of associates. So let's just, uh, let's just take a dive in on the compensation plan. Let's just take a little look at this. So even at the, uh, at the director level, director 300, I should say, you can actually achieve some pretty significant incomes um, at this level. Also, you can uh, bronze, um, you can earn the averages uh, over $2,000 a month. Um, and, you know, the director level, these, by the way, these ranks or these incomes are based on qualifying, you know, each week at the, at these different levels. So you're consistently paid at those ranks and uh, bronze levels. There's people that have made over $5,300 uh, for the month, just on at the bronze level, the diamond level. This is where things get really exciting. Again, these figures are, based in US dollars. So if you want to extrapolate those, that's a, a significant increase if you're in Australia, for example, because you um, because of the exchange rate. And so look, um, the average diamond is making um, nearly $16,000 a month. So pretty, pretty amazing. Uh, Ambassador diamond and, and above these is this would be the presidential ranks and the ambassador rank, so you can see that the income level is quite significant. So literally, whatever your dreams, goals, and aspirations are, all you gotta do is just make the decision and go after it, because this is uh, nothing complicated about network marketing. All you need to do is learn to do a few simple things and learn to do them well. So in terms of the compensation plan, just to let you know that there are eight different ways that we get paid in the compensation plan, and we're just gonna run through these uh, fairly quickly. Um, so when you dial this down and you look at it, uh, the first part we're going to talk about is fast profits, the way that you make money quickly. And I love ASEA's compensation plan because it really is generous. Uh, it's a hybrid plan. So it's a binary plan. We build, a, we build two legs. We'll talk about that. But there's also ways that we get paid quickly um, through this system. And 
Uh, we'll go through that. The next part of this is where you can create residual income. This is through team commissions and executive bonus, momentum bonus pool. And then uh, the third stage is really where you're creating legacy building income, where you can literally participate in a percentage of the global volume and, and also a check match where you're, when you're in the executive ranks that you really want to see your people and your downline, your team succeed because you're actually benefiting a little bit by, by what they do. It's called check match. So let's, uh, let's take a look at this. One of the things that I find very exciting is that a CF actually pays out, uh, whoop, literally just hit that slide again, they pay out 50% of the global volume is paid to associates. Now I wanna emphasize something here because there's a lot of companies that say that they might pay up to X amount, might even be a higher amount, but when you look at the breakaway volume and so forth, based on the compensation plans, it ends up being significantly less. A CF pays a full 50% to the, uh, to the associates, which I think is absolutely generous, super generous and brilliant because the other 50%, a CF manufactures the product, they, they pay for the employees, they take care of all the regulation, um, they, uh, all, the, all the parties and, com and uh, conventions and things like that that they put on for us, they do all that out of their 50%. We get to do the fun part, which is go out and talk with people. So that's pretty cool. And uh, it's a very generous compensation plan. They pay out weekly. I love this too, because every week keeps people engaged. Um, some a lot of companies pay out on a monthly basis. And so, um, so people kind of wait, hold up, you know, wait till the next month to start and so forth. This really encourages people to get started straight away. Uh, not procrastinate and just keep going as they build their business. So the commissions are based on product volume. And obviously, um, you got to move product in order to make commissions. So uh, it's pretty easy because when you understand what this product is, it's something that you really, every single person that you love, that you care about, that you know, needs to know about this technology. And not everybody's going to believe you, but, uh, or it may not be right for everybody uh, based on their choices, but, um, but look, we have an obligation to get this message out to the world. So one case of product is 100 PV, a full skincare line of the Renew Advance is 150 PV, and a set of the nutrition products of these three products would be 115 uh, PV or personal or, or product volume points. So that'll give you kind of an idea of, of how the points actually work. And one of the things that's most, is really important, so let me just go back uh, one slide here, is that you wanna make sure that you remain active. Uh, per 100 points is your personal volume that makes you active with the product. One of the first rules of selling anything is to be a product of the product. It's really important that you, uh, um, you know, that you are, are using the, own, the, the products that, you, uh, that you're talking about. And so I would encourage you to use all of the products. Um, by the way, this 100 PV for qualifying purposes does also count uh, customer volume too. So if you have retail customers or even preferred customers, that also counts towards your monthly qualification of 100 points, 100, P, 100 PV. So um, being active, the easiest way is to be on auto ship. We highly encourage everybody to be on auto ship. Uh, this is where you're setting up a, a monthly order so you don't even have to think about it. The time that your product should be about running, running low or running out you've already got product on its way coming to your doorstep. So I think of this as setting people up for success. So when people get started, regardless of whether it's a, a retail, a, whole, a preferred customer, or what I prefer to do is to set people up as associates, I think it's really important to just make sure that you set them up on an auto ship because one of the greatest advantages is a CIA is gonna compensate them with a loyalty reward program. And, uh, and that's pretty cool, the, the LRP. What that means is they get points toward free product. And uh, I don't know about you, but my favorite price is free. <laughs> and ASEA has literally sent us thousands of dollars of free product just because we purchased our product through the, through the auto ship program. And that gives us uh, points toward free product. So, um, so except, uh, so to be active, it's a hundred points with the exception of Thailand and the Philippines. They've actually made that a little easier for qualifying based on kind of the market there and that's only 50 points to remain qualified. So that's, that's pretty cool um, that, they've, that they've made that uh, um, advantage for, that, for those markets. And all the magic begins with being active. So you wanna make sure that you're active um, because then you're, like I said, you're leading by example, you're using the products, you've got your own stories and experiences that you can share with people. So everything in this, 
everything in this presentation is coming or video if you're watching this on a video later is coming from um, is based on US dollars and so uh, I think I mentioned that before but that's uh, how it is so first of all let's talk about the first way to get paid which is retail sales so retail is pretty simple it's uh, um, just the difference of wholesale versus retail uh, which is 25% and you get paid the difference so if you're if someone's ordering through your website the company's going to pay you on the following Friday uh, that difference so here's what this looks like uh, let's say that you've got three friends and they say hey I just want to I just want to order some product I'm not interested in doing anything I just want to give it a go then what you would do is is that product the difference between the retail and the wholesale would be uh, the cost to them would be hundred and sixty dollars so if we extrapolate that that difference you would basically get a bonus of, of ninety dollars based on the retail uh, the retail customer so if we look at it this way um, let's see uh, retail customers the on average uh, people would make about fifty dollars a week as retail customers there are some top earners that are making a making a thousand dollars a week as selling the product um, so you can absolutely do this about retail is send them one of the easiest ways you've got a, a website so whatever your login name is um, it might be uh, John Smith and it would be dot team is dot uh, .com. that would take them right to your front page of your website and right there they can click uh, order they could enroll right there as well but they could simply place an order that's an easy way to send someone to your website and the difference is paid the following week as I mentioned so this counts towards your personal volume also and any remaining volume above 200 points will be added to your lesser leg volume so let's say that you're already on a couple a couple uh, uh, a couple cases of product a month at which so you've already got your 200 points um, well what's going to happen is that that uh, that new order for let's say a hundred two three four hundred points whatever it is will actually go down to your lesser leg and count that volume for the for, for all the way up which is pretty cool so um, let's use an example if you had five retail customers who each buy a hundred points let's say it's a, a, a case of ASEA or a case of Renew 28 um, that would be um, a total of 500 points so 200 points would count towards your personal uh, volume maintenance and the other 300 points would float to your lesser leg. So there's a good example for that. So the next thing, let's talk about the next way to get paid, which is preferred customers. So preferred customers, um, they enroll. In order to be a preferred customer, you need to have an auto ship enrollment. Um, that's that's how they stay. Now you only get half the points, but you do earn a little bit more commission. So for every case, you're going to actually earn 25 points. Um, or excuse me, 50 points, but instead of 100 points, but it's going to be $25 for each case um, that way. So, um, so let's just take a look at this. If you've got five people who are preferred customers, and let's say each of these customers are ordering one case. Let's say it's four tubes of Renew 28 that are on auto ship. What's going to happen is every single month, you're going to make $25 on, that, uh, on those orders. And the second month, you're going to make another 25 for each one, $150. Again, this is based in U.S. dollars, so whatever the conversion rate is for uh, for wherever you're at, um, for let's say Australia or Singapore, or whatever, it's going to be a little higher. So, just do that conversion. Conversion. So, preferred bonuses. Um, the average person would probably make an extra fifty dollars uh, based on preferred customers, and top earners would uh, earn a thousand dollars and and upwards too. So you've got an excellent potential there for making some money as a, through preferred customers. So again, preferred customers have to be on auto ship. And if they're not on auto ship, then they revert to a retail customer. Um, they also, preferred customers also earn loyalty reward points just like associates do. And one case of ASEA or one case of Redox is, uh, is equivalent to 100 points normally, um, but in but it counts for 50 points toward commissionable volume. So on your tree, on your back office, it'll show us 50 points instead of, instead of 100 points. And they earn, uh, to begin with, if they, they would earn five loyalty reward points uh, from the beginning, um, 
and then that will increase over time, just like the other loyalty reward points up to as much as 20 points or 20%, excuse me. So this counts towards your personal volume. Um, note the CV, the CV counts towards your personal volume and any remaining volume will be added to the lesser leg. Uh, personal, um, let's see, they, uh, they also, now this is important. So preferred customers do not hold a position in the binary tree. So they're not eligible for any, comp, any commissions. And that's why, um, so you, if, they want to, if they want to say, well, hey, I'd like to start a business, it's literally enrolling them into a whole new position. So it's not just promoting or upgrading them. There is no position in the compensation plan. So personally, I choose to just set people up on, with an account. Uh, there's a small fee to set them up with an account, but they've got a position in the compensation plan that way. And so, you know, so if they, if they want to share this with anyone, they're going to benefit um, easier and we can build a team. So, um, so preferred customer or associate depends on your strategy. Some people, um, I guess, particularly some health professionals, some doctors and so forth would have more retail or preferred customers. Uh, again, it just really depends on your strategy. If someone's absolutely not interested in building, uh, sharing this with other people, then you know you could certainly look at that as a strategy. Typically, I just uh, like to set them up with an account, but again, that's your your choice. So let's talk about one of the uh, one of the cool things. This is really the place where I I get excited, and this is when we enroll people and get them started with an account. Then we get fast start bonuses, and this is uh, this is really where I kind of uh, hone in and and to pay attention to. It's, the, it's a one-time bonus at the time of enrollment. So that's important to note. Enrollment product pack uh, examples, there's a number of different um, choices here. Uh, this is an entrepreneur pack example of kind of a whole suite of the products. There's a business, uh, a business pack. Um, there's several different choices. Just go into your back office and the different markets will show different options that you could have. Or you could have just a personal, a personal redox pack, which is let's say a case of ASEA and a couple tubes of Renew 28, that's a, a good place to get started. Personally, I, I like to share with people the advantages of coming in with a little bit more uh, product. Again, I like to think of it as setting people up for success. And what that means is it's a great idea to have a little bit of product to, to use, to demonstrate and to sell. And I also find that people tend to duplicate what you do. And so when Melissa and I came in, we didn't have a budget for, um, you know, for redox signaling molecules. In fact, finan finances were pretty tight. But you know what, we just made a decision that we were gonna treat it like a business. And so uh, we made an investment into um, a little bit more product and without, within hardly any time at all, we had earned our money back and much, much more. So you can see the points of these packs as well. So it just gives you an idea of what the commission is. So you actually earn 20% of, of the full CV, of the full commissionable volume. So let's say an entrepreneur pack, this is up to a thousand points. So let's say this pack is a thousand, uh, 1,015 CV, so you get um, 20 percent or 200 U.S. dollars <clears throat> as a commission based on starting someone out with uh, with a pack like that. Bottom line is it's good for you as a as an enroller for helping them to get started, but it's also a smart decision for them. Plus, there's other advantages too. They they save a they save a, a pile of money by doing it that way, and they start off at 15 percent loyalty benefit right off the right off the bat. So. It's a, it's a good way to get going and there are really good advantages to that. So let's, uh, let's just take a look at some of these options. This is, uh, let's say for example, that you enrolled four people and they, uh, and this was the bonus 20, 40, 60, 80. They came in with four cases of product or 400 points. That would give you a fast start bonus of 80 US dollars per person for each one of these four people. So that'd be a $320 $20 fast start. So that's uh, it's pretty generous while well, you're just getting started. So it's great to be able to get a nice little, uh, nice little bonus for helping people to get started and set them up and, uh, uh, for success. So fast start bonuses, that can be an average of like 100 bucks or uh, the top earners are earning uh, $1,500 or more for helping people to get started uh, this way. Now, about the fast start bonus, uh, don't be confused with fast forward. That's something entirely different. Um, we can talk about that. Fast forward is an incentive uh, promotion, an incentive scheme, and that's basically where you're enrolling four people within um, within uh, 14 days, and the company sends you some additional 
uh, incentives to do that. It's great because it helps you to kind of get things uh, moving quickly. So uh, only paid once to active associates. So again, the fast start bonus is just paid at the time of in, for the at the time of enrollment. So you can't go back in later and do a an enrollment pack to get these uh, these bonuses. That's encouraging people to get started uh, started properly to begin with. Get a little bit more product. So the other thing I found is that uh, yeah, if you got a little bit of skin in the game, if you got a little bit more money invested in your in your business, you're probably more likely to take action. <laughs> You're going to want to get returns quicker, and that's the way. I, that's the way that Melissa and I looked at it. That's what we did. So, uh, again, the, it's capped at a thousand points. So, you know, someone can't go in and buy, um, you know, uh, three thousand points worth of product and get the and get the commissions. It's capped at the two th at the thousand points or ten cases of product, and uh, so that's how that works. So let's talk about the next thing, which is the director bonus. Now, this incentive is pretty cool because it's actually designed to help people get started very, very quickly in their business. So if this is you and you signed up today, um, you actually have 14 full or you have 14 days to get this uh, director's bonus, but it's actually um, you, you got to achieve the director's rank. So what that means is that you're active number one, meaning that you've got at least 100 personal enrollment points for yourself and that you've signed up two people that, uh, that also have, um, have auto ship, they're on auto ship and, uh, and enrolled in your business. So to achieve the director's rank, that's the, the two things, you'll collect an additional $50. So, so it's important to note that you've got two full business weeks. So let's say today is, is Monday. Um, well, we're, we've already ch chewed into a couple of the days of this week. So you're, actual two weeks would start uh, on, on Saturday, well, midnight, Friday night um, in New York time. So that's Saturday, Saturday early afternoon in Australia, New Zealand, and, uh, and uh, Asia, for example. So that's, that's how that works. You got two full weeks to get that extra $50 to get started. So, and that's what they call the director bonus. So let's just take a look at it. You've got uh, yourself and two other people that you've brought in. And you also earn the fast start bonus on these people as well, by the way, that you personally brought in. Um, so this, uh, this fast start bonus uh, is minimum of $40 and a maximum of $400. Um, now the people who complete the, this director's bonus, uh, something interesting that the company worked out is they figured that you are 13 times more likely to achieve the level of bronze if you've earn the director's bonus and you're actually 15 more times likely to go diamond. So it's, uh, it's really important to help your people to take action immediately and help get a couple people started in their business. So uh, you're, you're really just helping get, get momentum started in the beginning and literally that is a good uh, path for duplication and success. So a little bit about the director's bonus. You have to, um, you have two Full commission periods to achieve that, uh, as I mentioned before. So a little highlight. The easiest way to, to think of this is, is uh, the first Friday. Again, this is based on uh, USA time zone, um, and that would be uh, midnight uh, New York time is when you're, the, the next week actually starts. So you have actually two full weeks from that time to achieve this. So let's talk about uh, the next one, which is team commissions. So team commissions is really cool. Now this is where the binary uh, tree comes into play and we're building, we're building a left leg and we're building a right leg of your business. So you're at the top, you've got a hundred points personally, which is your, your PV and you are a director when you've sponsored someone on your left and someone on your right. Okay. That's what we already talked about. So this is what that structure looks like. Now what we're going to do is we're going to build these two legs, a left leg and a right leg. And as you grow your team, uh, this is kind of what it looks like. So, um, so as, and that would just grow on down. So let's say, for example, that you've got 6,000 points on the left side, uh, which would be 60 cases of product, and you've got 500 points on your right side. What's going to happen is the company is going to pay you 10% of your lesser leg. So that means 10% of 5,000 points is 500 US dollars. It's going to be paid in your, to your lesser leg. So 
what and that maxes out and by the way um that extra effect let me just go back uh one more i just want to just share this with you again um sorry so you got six thousand points on the left side five thousand on the right side and i forgot to mention that you've got a thousand points which is carried over until your next week because you haven't been paid on that thousand points so that was the part i felt to mention that i wanted to make sure that you understood that that volume on the on the left leg wouldn't go away. You actually that's like equity toward the future, and so you can always uh, maximize that by building the right leg and kind of catch up. So it's great the way that you're building two teams. Now, the team commissions actually you can earn a full ten thousand U.S. dollars every single week. Um, that's where it maxes out. So I don't know if anybody on this call could use an extra ten thousand dollars a week. Say I, <laughs> but it's a really cool way to create. Um, some residual um, income as you're building your team. And that's based on, that's why it's so important to get people on auto ship every single week too, because you want to make sure that, that that volume creates the residual income that you're looking for. And you want to make sure that people have the results on the product. And the best way to do that is to continually be on the product. So we are, in, in terms of placement, uh, we're building two teams now. Um, the company, your first person is going to go um, on depending on your on your team, it's gonna go on what you call your team leg, whether that's left or right, depends on, on where you're placed. But uh, you're going to, the computer's gonna automatically place people on wherever the lesser volume is. So in terms of placement, you really don't have to worry about this. The company's gonna place one on one side and then the next person will go on the, on the other side. And then after that, the computer's gonna place people wherever the lesser volume is. So, um, so they take the guesswork out of us. You don't really have to worry about that at all. Uh, again, the team commissions average about 200 and top earners are, are making 10, 000, earning 10,000 US dollars a week um, based on the team commissions. So a little bit about team commissions, all volume under your left uh, and right team counts toward commissionable volume, uh, no matter who brought that in. So sometimes you can benefit from your upline who has put someone in that ends up in your downline tree. Well, the, all that volume counts as well, whether you sponsored them or someone else did. Um, or people that you brought in who sponsored people and so forth. It doesn't matter uh, who it is. All that volume counts. Um, again, the cap is 10,000. And there is a cap on the different levels. Um, so Director 300, you can earn an extra $500 based on these team commissions. Um, silver, 15, 1,500. Uh, triple Diamond, five or 10,000. So you can see that a uh, little bit of a cap on these different levels. And that's why it's always good to uh, continue to, to move up. Now, in terms of, of your team, this is, uh, this is pretty cool to see. Um, we always like to give a little bit of a snapshot to give you an idea about creating this rig residual income. Remember in the beginning, I said it's not about what, uh, what works, it's about what duplicates. So we want to make sure that we bring our team members in and help to create that. So the average bronze is earning around a little over 2,000 US dollars um, a uh, a week and let's see, excuse me, a month. And what we're talking about here is the average bronze would be about 120 to 130 people in their downline. Um, now, some of those people would be ordering, you know, uh, at any different level of product. And by the way, all those people may not be active in your business, but you're going to have some people that stay active and some people that order product later, or some people that even drop out. But if you, if you kind of think of it in terms of numbers, and you think, well, I, want, I need to have about 120 to 130 people in my downline on each side of my business. That's going to equate, equate to about 20 cases of product being ordered every single month. So at 100 points, that's 2,000 points. And that's what it is to go bronze is 2,000 points on your left side, 2,000 points on your right side, and you're qualified at bronze. The other thing you want to be looking in terms of the growth of your business, and this would equate to about five new enrollments each week as you're building and growing your team. At the at the bronze level, so that's just kind of a, a great little target to uh, to shoot for. The silver level, um, you're making about a little over thirty six hundred dollars a month. Um, your group is growing. You got about one hundred and eighty people on each side or more, and that would equate to three thousand points or thirty cases of product. And you want to be targeting to be growing your business about seven new enrollments on each side, or at least where your lesser leg is um, each month. Um, gold, you can see what the uh, what the income is over there, about 60, almost 6,300. And you wanna be shooting for about 10 enrollments a week on your left and your right side. This is a healthy business that's growing, that's duplicating. 
and so forth. And then uh, platinum, um, you can see the numbers here. Average platinum is earning about uh, a little over $12,000 a month. And you can also see that um, in new enrollments, um, you should have about 500 to 550 on each side of your business or more. Um, to qualify at platinum is, is 10,000 points on the left and the right side, meaning about 100 cases. Well, 100 cases is, is 10,000 points. And so 10, 15 enrollments left and 15 enrollments right is a good target for that. And then, uh, and then uh, the last one that we'll highlight here is diamond. And you can see that the incomes and as your team is growing and you're creating duplication and you're helping things, you're gonna have more people, about 150 cases that you need to qualify. And you wanna be shooting kind of a target for again, a healthy growing business, about 20 new enrollments every week. So that's pretty cool as you're creating the duplication. So we've, um, we've covered uh, we've covered all these different ways of earning money. Um, but what I want to share with you now is, it, is something really exciting, which is an executive momentum uh, pool. Well, actually, we've covered everything up to team commissions to, to just clarify. Okay. Um, uh, ASEA has implemented a, a pool. Now, this is great because we actually have an, an incentive to help everybody globally with ASEA because literally you can get a piece of the volume, a piece of the commissions of the global sales within ASEA. Now, this executive momentum pool um, or EMP bonus is, uh, is based on um, a percentage of the global sales for 12 weeks at bronze, uh, 16 weeks at silver, 20 weeks at gold, and 24 weeks in, uh, in the platinum pool. So. Uh, for a total of 72 weeks, you've got the opportunity to collect uh, a percentage, your percentage of 2% of the global sales. This is paid out every four weeks uh, based on the published calendar uh, in our back office. So, so let's just kind of have a little walk through this. Um, again, you don't have to know everything about this. Um, when you get to this point, you can understand a little bit more, but just kind of have a high level view to have a basic understanding of it. And also it's good even in the beginning, if you're getting started to know what you're shooting for, because there are certain things that you want to do to, as you're building your business to kind of be thinking about how you're structuring. One of those things that is right here is this is paid to your personal group, three levels in depth. Now, I see it tracks things two different ways. They track things as you're um, in your left leg and your right leg, but they also will track things, how you personally sponsor people. So if you've sponsored, for example, uh, in this case, you can see three people. Well, those are all first level to you and the people that they've sponsored are second level uh, and so forth. So this is the way that this is tracked is your personal group, three levels in depth. So if you had 10 people that you sponsored, all those 10 people would be first level. So, uh, so you just look at that. This is called your PGV3 and this is what you're paid on in this global pool. So uh, in C ASEA wants to incentivize you to really kind of get, get rolling and put people in that you personally sponsored and not just work in depth, but to work in with to begin with. Now, the points that you earn, you're paid 50% of this, uh, of the points in your pool at the bronze level, 60% at the silver level, 75% uh, in the gold and 100% of the points that you earn in the platinum pool. And by the way, these pools can be pretty significant. Um, so let's just take a little bit of a dive into this. Let's say for example, at bronze, you need 2,000 points or 20, um, 20 cases of product each week. Um, 20 cases equals 2,000 points. So let's say that you've got 1,000 points. Um, well, you've got 2,000 2, personal group volume points, PGB3. Now 50%, because you can see at bronze, you earn 50% of that. So you have 1,000 pool shares that you're going to get paid on. From, the, from this global pool of, of sales. So at the gold level, for example, that's uh, 75%. So let's say you had 6,000 personal group volume points in your, your PGV3, that would be 4,500 uh, points in the pool shares. So you just divide it like that. So here's how you unlock this, um, which is, so when you've hit bronze for two weeks in a row, two consecutive weeks, that's when you unlock this pool. And that makes that pool available to you for the next 12 weeks. Now, um, let's say for example, uh, when you hit silver, then that 
opens that pool. When you hit that for two times in a row, then you open up this pool for 16 weeks. Uh, the gold, when you've hit gold for two weeks in a row, that opens up this pool for, um, for 20 weeks. And the platinum level, uh, very exciting. This gets very rewarding, by the way. Um, when you hit platinum for two weeks in a row, then that open, unlocks or opens the, uh, the platinum pool for up to 24 weeks. So it's, it's pretty cool how that works. So let's just use an example. Let's say, for example, that you've gone bronze. And before this 12 week expires, you go ahead and, and you've hit the silver level. Well, guess what? It doesn't mean that you're not gonna earn the, the bronze pool. You're actually gonna be incentivized because you're gonna now start getting paid at the, in the silver pool of shares. So you can actually earn more money quicker. Um, there's every advantage to keep, to keep going and you'll continue to, uh, this, you don't uh, diminish anything that 72 weeks continues to roll forward. And then when you unlock these other um, areas, then you still continue to get paid on those. But let's use an example here um, that you've got the 12 weeks of going bronze. Uh, let's say you've unlocked this pool at bronze. So you've, got, you've hit bronze for two weeks in a row. Well now, let's say that you uh, qualified the next week, you're gonna go ahead and get paid the, the shares on that bronze week in week number one. But let's say for example, week number two, um, you didn't quite hit it and you dropped back to qualifying at director 700. Well, it doesn't, um, it's not like starting over. You just don't get paid in the pool for that particular week, but you will get paid in the pool for the remaining weeks. Now let's say for example, on week eight, that you hit the silver level. Well, the first week that you're not gonna get the, the silver shares, but the second week that you hit that, you've unlocked the silver pools and you are gonna jump up to the 60% of the silver bonus. So you're gonna get paid at the silver level right there and then. So uh, the rest of those weeks, that's just gonna to continue to go out. So um, we use one more example. Um, let's say as, as you, uh, uh, hit your silver pool, you the 16 weeks, so you've completed the bronze pool. Now you're actually moved into the 16 weeks of the silver pool. And let's say that you drop back to the bronze level on week three out of these 16 in the silver pool. What's gonna happen is you won't, um, you'll still get paid at the bronze level because, uh, um, let's see, yeah. No, actually you won't get paid because you've actually gotten paid through that whole process. You've gone the 12 weeks with the, with the bronze pool. So that week you would actually miss. So if you drop back to, to bronze while you're in the silver pool now, you're gonna, you, would, you wouldn't get the commission at that time. But the rest of the weeks, you certainly would. And if you hit the gold level, you're gonna go ahead and pick up the gold level uh, bonus pool and platinum and so forth. So that's how that works. Um, look, the average, uh, Executive momentum pool is about $1,000 and the top earners, this is actually conservative uh, because um, uh, I know many people that have earned commissions in excess of the $10,000 uh, $10, for the four weeks. So uh, it's a very lucrative pool, particularly at the, at the platinum level. So it's a, a great thing called the EMP, executive momentum pool bonus. So you have to hit your rank uh, twice to open this, to open this up, that unlocks it. Um, the reason that that's set for two weeks is because that kind of protects you because as you noticed, if you fall back and you're not qualifying, you might miss out on that commission. So, so it's a good idea to take a look and, and judge to make sure that you actually have uh, an organization that's going to push you to go ahead and continue to qualify each week to, when you've opened up that pool because you want to, trust me, you want to continue to get paid within those pools. So open up those pools when you're ready. You can kind of strategize that. If you have questions, get with your sponsor, your upline and say, hey, you know, I could, I might be able to qualify for my second week. You know, where should I, what should I do here? Um, if you've got a strong organization that's growing, just go for it. Put yourself under that pressure to keep building and growing and keep the momentum. So uh, a smart way, to, smart way to think about that. Now, the next way that we're going to talk about getting paid is something called check match. Now, as you grow and build your business, um, I can tell you that the, the top income earners, this is actually where they, um, where they get really their, their highest commissions is in team commissions. So this is pretty cool. Um, we've got our binary tree. Now, I've already kind of explained this a little bit. So the company tracks you two different ways. Um, 
The first way is your legs, your binary tree. So let's say, for example, the people in blue are the people that you personally sponsor. Now, the company is going to track those people frontline to you as well. So they track your personal sponsored legs. The people in orange um, are the people that they've sponsored. So that would be second level to you. And the people in purple are the third level. It's the people that, uh, that the people in orange have sponsored. So you can see how this is tracked and, and how this grows on out as you put more people in. So check match uh, is a percentage of the team commissions up to seven generations in, per, in your personal sponsored tree. Now, the word generations is pretty important here. Let me just explain this. So we... So for example, if you're at the bronze level, you're paid one generation. So that would go down to the next bronze level underneath you. If you're silver, it would go not to the to the two generations of bronze level. So it's actually paid for organizations or groups up to seven, seven generations in depth. So let me just clarify what that actually looks like a little bit more. Um, so let's say you're a silver level associate and you've sponsored um, Anne and John and David and underneath those people is Sarah. Well, Sarah is now a bronze level associate. So that is your, um, that is your, your team. That's your first generation. So that's four levels in depth, but you've got, uh, you're going to get paid on, on the team, on the, uh, check match in this group as one level. Now let's say we've got Kara, Frank, Sue, and whoops, and all those people, let's see, yeah, and let's see, yep, yeah. so John, Dave, so all those people are your second generation. So you can see that this is paid in groups up to seven levels in depth. So each one of those director 300s, director 700s, they've got their, their teams that are growing. So this actually uh, uh, is quite a few people that you're actually getting a, a small percentage of, but it's a percentage of their check. So it benefits you to help your team grow and you want to help them to earn commissions as soon as possible because you're going to benefit from that too. So this is where 50% of the global volume comes from, from all of these um, areas. As we mentioned, the retail preferred customers, the director bonus and so forth. So uh, check match, um, check match payments. Um, the average check match would be about $500 and the top earners are earning in excess of 20,000 US dollars uh, per, uh, per month or per week, excuse me, on check match. So again, this is a very lucrative way to earn money as you've grown and built your team. That's one of the advantages of bringing people in as associates and helping to, to, uh, to build their team and help them to succeed. So uh, a little bit about check match. Um, you have to be paid at the rank each week to enjoy the check match. So in other words, if you're, um, if, if you're a, a, a diamond, you want to get paid at diamond so that you can get the benefit of the check match at that level. So let's say, for example, if you're a bronze, but you're not paid at bronze, you're not going to get the check match because you got to get paid at bronze to qualify for the check match on that first generation. Um, if you're a silver and you're paid at bronze, you'll get paid at one level, not two levels, for example. Um, this, is, this is really a leadership bonus. So it's a function of leadership when you help your team to earn, um, you earn. So just win-win all the way. There's absolutely no cap on this, uh, on the check match. So it's a, it's a great way to build. And the last way to earn money is the global uh, diamond pool. So this is, this is pretty exciting. So when you hit the diamond ranks, there's a 2% pool that goes to the diamonds um, to share based on what their volume is. So I'll just kind of briefly recap this. And uh, uh, ASEA has promotions and programs that are really pretty cool um, that help you to achieve uh, trips that you can go on, all this kind of stuff. So the... Uh, yeah, so this is the eight different ways to get paid through the ASEA's compensation plan. And if, uh, and BK has a, uh, a little link there that if you wanted to take a, to scan that or take a picture of that, I believe it goes to a recording of, uh, of this presentation as well. So with that, I would like to uh, 
say I'll stop the screen share and uh, I think I will. There we are. Stop share. And I would like to thank you guys for jumping on tonight's uh, tonight's recording. Hope you got something something out of that. And we'll uh, we'll see you down the ASEA Highway. All the best. Let's see. I did stop the. Um, let me see one last thing. Yeah, let me just stop right there.